So of course, one of the things that you're going to want to do is to see a client's results. So I want to show you a few different ways on how you can check that out. So let's go check out a client here. So I'm gonna go over to my client's page. I'm gonna select a client. Now, first place is to check out past performance. And you may have seen this in another video, but let's touch on it really quickly, just in case. So I can go to past performance here and any task that has been added to my task library and that the client has completed will show up in past performance. So Romanian deadlift, for example, I can see that they last performed it on this date and that was their result they typed in. I can also click on actions here and it will list out uh, the results that they did. So for example, if you had a weigh-in task, right, you can see all of their weights listed here. And you can also see the plan that this result was associated with. So that is one way that you can go about doing it. And another really neat way or neat thing that you can check out is under actions. So this result for this plan, if I click here, I can actually see everything else that was done with that task. So if this was a workout, for example, and I noticed that that, that result was maybe a little bit lighter than they had been lifting, I can see some additional context here that just provides me with some information about, you know, programming for them in the future, that maybe it was just not a great combination. Uh, another thing that you can do is go over to the completed tab, right? And there are kind of two things that you can go in to see a client's uh, results. So if we look at this, for example, I can click this little phone icon and it will show everything that they did in this little viewer here. Now, there's not a ton of space here, so what you will need to do is you'll need to kind of click and drag, but you can see, let me find something else here. Uh, obviously, I was just playing, so I didn't put in some fun results. Let's see, there we go, right? So we just need to scroll over a little bit to see the rest. So that's one way to do it. Another way to do it is, to go into edit plan and view as client and it shows that same viewer and we can again scroll over to see the full uh, note that they left right so that is how you would see any uh, anything that they would have put in the results box for their plans let's actually go back a little bit Right. And then also keep in mind that, you know, down here you have your client's comments, you know, so it might be that you, you know, ask them to leave it, some additional feedback, but there's not enough information in that box. So they may leave you some additional context um, notes, right, um, in their comments at the end. So be sure to check there as well. But that's how you check for your client's results.